Okay, YouTube, so this video is going to be a tutorial on how to put homebrew cheats on your SD card and use them on Gecko OS or Ocarina. So what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to download both, Ocarina and Gecko OS. You need Ocarina for the code manager that you're going to get in the file, which is going to have a little picture of a, of a skeleton head next to it. And it's going to look like this. It's going to look like that. Now, what you're going to need is you're going to need to put the Gecko OS file into your applications file with everything in it. So, after you extract it. And then you're going to need to set up a text document of um, in your in an untitled notepad you're gonna need to set up a text file of all codes that you want so what you'd have to do is leave a space so press enter and then uh, the number for Super Smash Brothers Brawl would be R S B E and then you'd write O one Okay, so then you press enter again and write the name of the game. Super Smash Bros. And then what you do is you space again and then write the name of the code. So let's just go move swap. Just as an example. And then you'd put the random digits. This isn't a code or anything, it's just. An example. And then you're going to press enter to go to the next line and do it again. And then you'd have your code. And once you're done entering that code, you go on to the next one by pressing the space. And then have. And then, like this. And then pressing space again name of the code and then the code itself then you want to save it to somewhere you will, you will remember it I save all my uh, all my code files in the code manager 0 0.6 folder that I get, that's inside my applications folder but you can save it wherever you want and what you're gonna need to do to get the cheats onto your SD card you're going to have to have a codes folder. So if you have a codes folder, RGHE52 is Guitar Hero 3. And uh, what you're going to need to do is if you have a cheat file in there already, you're going to get rid of it. But you probably won't if you're looking up a tutorial on how to get the cheats. So you got to go into your applications folder where you put the code manager, double click and it'll open up and what you're gonna need to do is you're gonna need to open that cheats file uh, by pressing file open text file and then find it wherever you put it and then you're gonna open it up my cheats file looks like this so let me get that out and then it's uh, code manager super smash bros brawl 2 and then I'm going to have all these codes. And they're going to have little check boxes next to them. And you're going to pick what you want. Don't pick too many because then at one time. Because then the homebrew might not. Or whatever. Which one you're using. Uh, Ocarina or Gecko OS might not be able to load it at one time. Now. Uh, you pick whatever ones you want. So I'm going to pick a few random ones. Now I'm going to go to Super NES, Taunt to do player entry, and Super Falco. Oh. And I guess disable home run contest timer. Now, 
what you do is then once you're done picking your codes not too many you go save as no not save as text file you want to save no you don't want to save you want to go to file you want to export to GCT which is your codes folder that you made so you'd press store and I'm not going to but you'd press store and then you'd find a file in your codes folder so when you go back to your codes folder hold on when you go back to your codes folder you should find rsbe 01.gct and that'll be your cheat file and then what you do is you bring it to your Wii put it in and then run the whichever cheat thing you're using and then it should load the codes if you don't have too many uh, yeah I guess I will show you how that how it looks so I guess I'm gonna have to pick well, open Super Smash Brothers, and then now I want to. Shit. There we go. I want to put on a few move set swapping codes, and then I want to go. Like I said before, export to export to GCT. Then you're just gonna press store, and I'll say GCT fi file stored to F drive, which is your SD card, codes folder, RSBE01 GCT. Close out of everything, and it's all on your SD card. And then you got to put it in your Wii. Don't mind the noise, my brother's just watching TV. Press launch game. Or not. Codes should work, and if they don't, message me and I'll try and help.